everyone and welcome back to another video thank you for joining me today for my weigh-in update so yeah i've gone back to group really um enjoyed going back there it's definitely where i feel more at home more comfortable and you know there's people there that um i've got to like meet over the months and yeah i just felt that's where i should be so that was um a good step anyway so i was quite yeah you know i wasn't sure what to expect today because obviously last week i weighed on thursday um and then i weighed on my scales last thursday um so from the last weigh-in of slimming world which was two weeks today um, I'm getting a little bit confused in myself. I can't remember now what I was last Thursday. But anyway, let's just go back to what I was the last time I went to Simmer World. So I went, I come home from a holiday and I had gained seven pound. So then the week after that, I went to Simmer World and I lost three pound. So then I weighed last week at home on a Thursday now today i've weighed obviously back on the similar world scale so from the last time i weighed on the similar world scales i have actually gained one and a half so where i had lost three of my holiday gain i've only lost one and a half so i'm quite gutted about that but um as i said i don't really know last week's weigh-in i'm just going to forget last week's weigh-in because um it was my scales and you know they they're obviously different anyway um so yeah i i'm i'm surprised i put on one and a half i knew that i hadn't been i knew that i hadn't been 100 percent on plan you know when little things keep popping in and you're like oh just have that and those little things are the worst things because they all add up to like a bigger thing at the end of the day. So, um, yeah, so I was quite surprised to see a one and a half pound gain, but nevertheless, it, it is what it is. There's nothing I can do about it. And, um, yeah, I'm just gonna get, get on it 100% this week. Um, you know, like last week I thought I'd had a good week. But there are things now I think about, well, actually, yeah, you had that, you know, you had that. And you think you're going to get away with it, but you you don't. I don't, anyway. I personally can't get away with anything like that. I, I have to be, you know, I have to be so strict because anything that I have that's, that's you know, out of my um, that's going out of my sins or whatever, then it definitely shows that on the scale so so there we are um so but this week i really am focused and i hope it stays that way because i don't know what it is since i come back off holiday it just seems to be that i can't get that 100 percent focused again and i don't know why i really really want to and um you know obviously you know if you've been following me for a while i've been battling with this weight for quite a while now getting this last bit off to get to my goal weight but obviously I've got more now to lose than I had originally so I need to pull my finger out and just get on with it otherwise I'm going to be going round in circles all the time so um yeah I'm really really prepared for a good week this week I don't have anything particularly to get in the way apart from Sunday um Again, if you follow from me a while, you'll know that we do like going to um, the spring and autumn flower show, which is in Malvern. Um, so we go to that and obviously it is it's not quite as at one time before COVID hit and everything. They used to have loads and loads of different stores doing samples of like wine, rum, all sorts, cheese, meats pickles you know all sorts of things but uh, since covid i've noticed that it has reduced quite a lot you know there's not that many stores doing these samples 
but there are still some samples and some of them are like hot chocolate i mean you only get like the minute bit but again all these little bits that you may have soon add up so that is the only thing that i'm doing this week that may stand in the way but like i should be taking a picnic with me um we won't be stopping for a meal on the way home this time so i will have something in place that i know that i can come home and get you know so i'm not leaving everything and then panicking of what i'm going to do um so that's okay it's just those little samples which hopefully they won't have many out anyway and see you know when i am 100% on it those sort those sort of things wouldn't bother me but because i haven't had it hasn't just been i don't know my my mind hasn't been 100% on it so you sort of go off and have these little bits and pieces and as i say they just soon add up and um before you know it yeah you've had too many so anyway that is my weigh-in update so one and a half on um so i'm hoping that i'm going to sit here next week and tell you that i have lost that one and a half and a little bit more hopefully fingers crossed so i'm going to give it all my best shot this week and um yeah and we'll see what happens next week fingers crossed i come on here with a loss so i will um yeah i look forward to seeing what what i get next week so anyway thank you for watching and if you have had a weigh-in yet this week i hope you've had the result you wanted if not like me then just crack on and just keep plowing away and we will get there i'm definitely taking that long scenic route and but i will get there one day and i will be the happiest person i think when i get that target certificate so but it was so so good to be back in group today i really enjoyed it we had um our consultant was off today so we had like a standing consultant um so that was quite nice um, but yeah, anyway, I am going and I will catch you all again next week for my weighing update or tomorrow for my what I eat in a day. And I've got a shopping haul on tomorrow's what I eat in a day to load as well. So thanks so much for watching and I will see you all soon. Take care. Bye.